tupate hata kama ni way forward wanasemanga tu hivyo the National Assembly has unanimously passed a motion proposing the establishment of the National Dialogue Committee for talks between the Azmiolo Moja One Kenya Coalition and the Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance. The committee shall comprise of 10 members, five from each side, and will be supported by a technical team composed of four members from each side. The establishment of the committee stipulated in the motion moved by the majority leader Kimani Shunga has been necessitated by the need to anchor the talks in law. Members of parliament have welcomed the move, stating that the talks should start in earnest to solve the stalemate between the two camps. The motion will now be forwarded to the Senate for concurrence. We must disabuse that notion that this dialogue process has anything to do with handshake, nusumkate, or access to power by the minority in government. We want to entrench constitutionalism and the rule of law in our country so that after every election, whoever wins an election is allowed to govern and govern in peace. As we go into these talks, <coughs> we don't want to reduce the talks to an allied conspiracy. And that's why we have insisted, and the motion speaks to it, that these talks be, as, be, as, be made as open as possible so that the public can get an avenue to air their views. Na Kenya haiwezi kusonga mbele ikiwa taifa halina amani, ikiwa taifa halina mwelekeo mwishmi wa speaker. Hakuna maendeleo ambao tuneza kupata kama taifa kwa sababu hatuna amani katika taifa hili mwishmi wa speaker. These talks were held outside the framework of this house. We'll have lost this institution, Mr. Speaker. It's part of building parliamentary institutions, and I hope that in these talks, Honorable Chungu and Honorable Wandai will ensure that we keep building our institutions. This parliament, IEBC, the judiciary, building trust, Mr. Speaker, means accepting decisions made by bodies we've set up. 